and pager? That's made out of dantalum. Dantalum was the 73rd element, and transition metal with 73 protons and 73 electrons with 108 neutrons. Dantalum was discovered in 1923 by Anders Gustav Eckenberg with the density of 16.65 grams per centimeters cubed with a melting point of 3292 degrees Kelvin and a boiling point of 5730 degrees Kelvin. Dantalum has an atomic weight of 180.9479 atomic mass units and was named after the Latin word, Dantalus which means the king of Lydia in Greek mythology. It is a blue-gray, very hard metal with the fourth highest melting point of any metallic element. Further dispute over the results in 1846 led to the discovery of niobium as well. Dantalum is highly ductile and highly conductive of both electricity and heat. It is well known for its ability to resist corrosion by acid, even aqua regia, or the destructive nitrohydrochloric acid. It is believed that tantalum is found in the Earth's crust between 1 and 2 parts per million. There are a wide variety of minerals that contain tantalum, but only 5 that are viable for commercial uses at the present, eugenite, microlite, polycrase, tantalite, and wagenite. Of these minerals, tantalite is the most important for tantalum mining. Tantalite is almost identical to columbite, the mineral at the center of the early controversy about the element. When tantalum exceeds niobium in the mineral, it is labeled tantalite. When the niobium content is greater than that tantalum content, the mineral is columbite. Due to tantalum's high density, gravitational separation is the most common way to extract the element from minerals. Dantalum has two naturally occurring isotopes, one of which is stable. Dantalum's unstable isotope is the scarcest isotope in the universe. Dantalum has been studied as a potential salting agent in nuclear weapons, which would increase the radioactive fallout and affect a wider area. Through the theoretical dantalum salting, the intensity of the gamma rays to over 1 million electron volts each. Most of the tantalum used commercially is in its powdered form for building electronics. Tantalum is also widely used as an alloy due to its high melting point and anti-corrosion properties. Tantalum is also biocompatible, making it used in medical implants and the coatings of implants. Stay tuned for tungsten.